Hey there, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to manually add a new student to your course. Okay, so for whatever the reason may be, you might come across a need to be able to add someone manually to your course without going through the online login and registration process. All right, so I'm gonna show you how to do that. First thing I want you to do is go to your dashboard, go to users down here, you're going to click on Add New. Now, just uh, do any kind of username. I'm you're going to I'm going to delete this afterwards, so it doesn't matter. But you, of course, will want to oh screenshot or let your your uh, new student know what their username and email is. Okay, so I'm just going to call mine demo student email. I'm just going to put info at ladycoursecreators.com. First name is going to be demo. Last name, I'm going to say student. Website, it doesn't have one. I'm not going to worry about the password. Send a user notification. Yes, you're going to want to do this so that the new user can get an email about their account, as it says here. Make sure the role is set to customer. You don't want to, unless you have some reason for doing this. Um, but for our purposes and in this course, we want it set to customer. Think of it as also being known as a student, of course. And then you're going to say add new user. All right, so here's our new user called Demo Student, and we are now going to add this student to our course. So what you need to do is hover over the name, click on it. This is gonna bring you to the Demo Student's profile. All right, and there's lots of things you can do in this. Username is here, we have it as Demo Student. Confirm that it is, the role is student. We have all the other things down here. If you scroll down, and of course your new student can add their own profile, they can generate a new password, all kinds of goodness. So here's where you enroll them in your course. You're going to click on the title of your course. You should see a list here. Click on the title of your course, and you're gonna click on the arrow that's pointing to the right. All right, so now final step. Don't forget to do this. Click Update User. And now if we go back to our users and say all users, you're going to see that this user called Demo Student is now enrolled in your course. Okay, now there's um, other plugins and things like that, but this is the quickest, easiest way if you have one or two students you want to enroll manually. If you have an Excel file or something like that, or you know, a .cs .csv file, there are some plugins that all you need to do is um, go to your plugins, click add new. Um, we'll just do this real quick. All you have to do is go in here and you can say um, like manually or let's say dot CSV uploads, things like that. I have not done this, but I know there are a ton of uploads out there that will allow you to bulk enroll students in your course, okay? There's a bunch of them. Just make sure that they're active with your version of WordPress and then they've got a good, you know, rating. All right, so that's how you manually enroll a student into your course. All right, I'll see you in the next video.